What's going down, Molly Skyler fans? One of the better tours of the year that's starting it off. We just did a jalapeno contest in Laredo. Numbers stunk. We didn't do very good, but we woke up, got breakfast. We were in Alvin, Texas at the Red Oak Cafe. Super nice inside. The owner's really cool. It's a Christian based place, and uh, honestly, it smells good. Pancake challenges. So they have a six. A plate of six, I think it's for the time, is the record that you got for that one. And then the other one where you have to beat the progressive challenge to see if you can eat more. I think it's standing at 12. So now I gotta go for 14. I'm not huge on syrup, y'all know that, but I do like pancakes. You have to mix some stuff into the pancakes, see what's gonna go on with that. I'm excited to get breakfast. Mmm, breakfast. Love it. Pool's back there. Killer's back there. They like breakfast. Pool didn't want breakfast. But, Molly's got her mom and woman versus food. Looking for breakfast. Let's get inside. Alright guys, we've got the pancake challenge on. This is massive. Look at this. Oh, it's like bigger than my head. It's like two heads. It's like Mr. Pool. Oh my gosh. So I've got an hour to eat this and uh, I've got chocolate chips, I've got pecans, and I've got cinnamon sugar. So should be interesting. They got 12 pieces, I've got 14. I'd say six, seven pounds easily. But we'll see what happens. We're gonna eat some breakfast here and some chocolate on our hands, we're gonna be messy. Oh, let's well, scroll down to you in a bit. Alright, so we're getting ready to start here. Remember, 30 minutes. 30 minutes. Alright, let's do this. It's gonna be delicious. Start. And we're rolling. Okay. Very good. Bacon is on point. Hey Dan, I'm using a fork. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Huh. But for how long? That's the question, but for how long? Don't judge me. Pecan Andy Pool, that's where it's at. The fork might not last long, honestly. Mm, sugar. It's falling apart. Twelve isn't even gonna be easy. Huh? I don't think twelve is gonna be easy either. I got technique, Mr. Boo. Technique. Wow. They stick 
Chug off of that 64 ounces of syrup. Who won? <laughs> you can open your throat up here. Oh. Remember that one contest you can never beat me at? Exactly. <laughs> not my fault, I'm not good at butter cheese. <laughs> Actually, bun and cheese is delicious. It's the best part, Mr. Pool. I just—I never got the cheese with the with the raisins. You know what I'm saying? It didn't make any sense. Younger, 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 younger,
hustle year, and then from after I hustle, my 30s, my 20s, 30s, I'll be posting the rest of my life. That was literally like the best bite of pancake ever because it was like 10 pieces of bacon and a bunch of brown sugar right here. So much pancake. Mr. Boo, Mr. Boo. It's definitely not the biscuit box. You guys make that batter here? What's that? You make the batter here? The batter? We make it, yeah. Yeah, right. Buckwheat pancake? No, I haven't. Buckwheat? Buckwheat? Oh, yeah. Those are the ones that get all dry and mealy. It's like oh. gritty. It's almost like chewing on sandpaper. Yeah. So the guy, the guy that gave those to me is from... his 12th pancake for the pancake challenge. And Miss Molly is on number 14, <laughs> wrapping it up right here. <laughs> what do you think, Dan? Delicious. Yeah? Better than some buckwheat pancakes? Oh, heck yeah. Way better. <laughs> Our timer is so low. We're at 24 minutes. Oh my God.
can I can honestly say that those are the best whipping pancakes I've ever had. I never order pancakes on purpose. Unless it's like a challenge. But those are good. Yeah. But I mean forty pocky chips. Oh that was awful. There it is. All three of our challengers finished their challenge. Look at that. Mr. Boo. It is. It's more like something. They have to do 18 pancakes now? They have to do 18 pancakes to beat this and get it for free. It really does. I don't like carrying soup. This is like, you gotta save really still for soup. No. I'll let y'all enjoy it. I'm just using their extra butter because I didn't want to waste it. And I gave him my syrup because I don't like syrup, so. You want it back? No. So already talking about coming back, back next year after someone beats it. No. If someone beats her record, she gonna come back and beat there? No. Come back and beat it. I'm just gonna do. I'm just gonna beat myself. Is, don't, is very much so doable. You think so? Yeah. I want to do it today, but it's very doable. <laughs> well, those jalapenos are still hits and a little heavy, so. Look at that. 16 pancakes. She's hungry. Yeah. Way to go, Molly. They're good. So we ate pancakes. Like a lot of them. And we got 16 of them. So now, if you really want to come out and try to beat the record, you can do 18. But if you don't get out here by next year, I'm just gonna bring it, knock it up to 20. So we'll leave it doable for right now. And then by the time I come back out here next uh, February, I'll probably put it up to 20. So absolutely doable, totally delicious. If you're looking for a massive pancake challenge, Red Oak Cafe in either Alvin or League City. Alvin, this is the, this is the place that I came to because it rocks. But if you don't want to do massive plates of food, just get like, like a pancake or two. Or you try the regular or, challenge. Or 12. Or do the regular challenge. You like six. Like six. Like and subscribe. Follow these guys. They're kind of wusses. But, you know. Thanks for watching. If y'all want to sponsor something, let me know. Find me in the description below, and we'll go after that. But get some breakfast on. See you next time.